Question 11a, the point negative 1, 6 lies on a curve. This curve has the derived function dy dx equals to negative 4x cubed minus 9x squared plus 5. Show that this point is a stationary point of the, of the curve. Okay, so um, at stationary points, the y dx is always equals to 0. So if this point is on the curve, okay, it's a point of the curve. So by the time you substitute x, okay, for uh, negative one, okay, so you should get the you should get zero as the value of the y dx, okay. So that means the y dx will be equals to negative four into um, negative one, okay, cube, then minus nine into negative one, okay. So squared plus 5 negative 1 cube is uh, negative 1 cube is negative 1 times negative 4 that will be 4 negative 1 squared is 1 times negative 9 that will be negative 9 plus 5 okay so 9 subtract 9 that will be 0 okay so that means the y dx equals to 0 so since the y dx equals to 0 that means this point is uh, a stationary point of the curve okay so part b a different curve as the equation y equals to 2x cubed minus 6x plus a so calculate the gradient of the tangent to the curve at the point uh, minus 2 comma 2 okay so to calculate the gradient of the tangent to this curve so we need to uh, uh, differentiate these okay when differentiate this, so the differentiation okay function is the gradient, and we need to pass in this value. So that is, we have to do the y dx to be equals to this will be three times uh, two that will be six x raised to the power of three minus one that will be two. Then we have uh, one times six six. Then x raised to the power of one minus one that will be zero. So it will be minus uh, 6 okay so it's equals to at this point now so we can see that x equals to negative 2 so therefore the y dx which is the gradient will be equals to 6 into negative 2 squared minus 6 so this will be equals to negative 2 squared will be positive 4 4 times 6 you have 24 so minus 6 so the gradient is equals to 18 so that will be the gradient okay so b roman figure 2 find the x coordinate of the stationary point of this curve okay so we want to find the x coordinates of the stationary point of this particular curve okay so a stationary point the y ds is always equals to zero so that means you say okay, you can say at stationary point at the stationary point, okay, the y dx is equals to zero. And we already got the y dx to be this. So therefore, the y dx, uh, which is equals to six x squared minus six, okay. So we can see that six x squared minus six is equals to zero. So that is what we have here. So you have six x squared to be equals to six. So x squared equals to six over six. Okay, so x uh, squared equals to one, then x equals to plus or minus one. We take the square root of one. Okay, so you will have this here. So that is the coordinates of the stationary point of this curve. Okay, will be at uh, x equals to positive 1 okay, and x equals to negative 1. So that is what we're going to get. So this is the end of the uh, solution to the IGC, to the Cambridge IGCSA Mathematics paper 4 to written in May June 2024.